Now, on Saturday, there was no shortage of superheroes. Batman and Robin, Mario and Luigi, and everyone's new favourite hero, Miss Fluidity! It's Ellie and Vito, obviously. Vito's put together a wonderful package of a routine. Your job is to deliver that, and you do. It's so good. I was absolutely just blown away with that. Keep working on your fluidity, because I might have to call you Miss Fluidity. This is the third week in a row that you have given a really brilliant performance. I love, love, love that. And you. Vito, this is the first time you're on one of my shows. Now, let oh, me yeah. just start by saying you're not going to get any special treatment here. In fact, <laughs> it's going to be the complete opposite. <laughs> <laughs> For the first time. Really. For the first time. Okay. Oh, I'm so I'm glad really to have you here. OK. So, Ellie. <laughs> <laughs> you told Jeanette Enough about you. Week. Yeah, yeah. Say about me. you. You told Jeanette last week that you were struggling in training, but I was I was struggling to see where the struggle was. <laughs> no, last week was actually a really big struggle for me. I think... I don't even know what it was. I think the spinning of the Viennese waltz just really caught me off guard. And then spinning in hold and then coming out of that and then spinning some more. Like, I did actually really struggle. Um, but I think I think the struggle paid yeah, off. I say like we have to rotate on ourselves clockwise, <laughs> yeah. but we have to move anti-clockwise anti on the dance floor. So like you know, stay down but stay up. Yeah, stay yeah. down but stay up, <laughs> stay left. None like, of it makes sense. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> please make it no. make sense. Right, please. <laughs> there were so many spins. You covered the floor so much. Did you expect Ellie to do as well as she did? Because she smashed it. Honestly, no. She surprised me every single week <laughs> because in the rehearsal, she does good. In, you know, when we try, it's OK. And the, the night it's of okay. the show... Yeah, because they're like, OK, <laughs> she does the same. And then the night of the show, something happened. And I say, like, this is not the same Ellie I've been rehearsing oh. and practice the whole week. You know? And the spin comes and the frame comes and she's moving and everything is so precise. I like... OK, Ellie, OK. That's so, it, Ellie. I don't know element where, of surprise. No, but I, I feel like I don't know where it comes from. Like, in rehearsal, I genuinely feel like I'm struggling. And then I get on that dance floor and I'm like, oh. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. it. It's so weird. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like true. the weirdest feeling ever. Yeah. And you know what? You are doing it. You're definitely <laughs> doing it. And then some. Alito, Craig said that Ellie's free arm needs to speak more. And what yeah. does her arm need to be saying? Yeah, what? we need to use more like body language, you know? so we have to go more on the extension till the end, the end, the end of the nail of the finger. Yeah. yeah? And also we go on the fluidity, mm -hmm. yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah? So we don't have to lose our, our you know, What's this? What flex, using flex, you know, like this. OK. Yeah? And <laughs> <laughs> Use, use all of that. Use, use all of that. that. Yeah. But we are, we are working on it, actually. You know, we constantly work on it. Yeah. So we have, like, everything written, and every every time every time we go to the rehearsal, we practice on think like, different things yeah. from previous and next. Because yeah. the judges want us... Like, they want everybody to succeed. Like, they, they want to make us yeah, better, they and they want to help us. So it's important that we listen to every single thing that they're saying. Absolutely. Yeah, well, you know what? I've done some analysis. So, uh, each week, you've improved by two points, week on week. So, you started here week one, you were at 29. Oh. Then you progressed to 31 week two. Ooh. And week three, 33! Oh. Ah. I, mean, I mean, look at that. Look at that mean, beautiful look at the growth right there. Feel the depression now. now. <laughs> is it important to not let the standard slip now? Because you've got an upward trajectory there. It's looking nice. Yeah, yeah. definitely. I think every week, I just want to make sure that I'm doing my best and really pushing myself. And we've had some amazing scores and, and some ma amazing feedback. Um, so, yeah, it's a lot of pressure to kind of keep keep going. Yeah, but you're doing well. You're doing well. You are. Thanks. You're smashing it. The public are loving your progress. <laughs> yeah, Martha posted this online. <laughs> Astounding how you can go from nothing to this in just a few short weeks, one to watch. Oh, thank you, oh, that's Martha. That's true, that's true. How does it feel, Ellie, when people say you're one to watch, like you're the dark horse? How does that make you feel? I feel it like it's a little bit strange. I think because people are so used to seeing me play a character and, like, now I'm myself and people go, oh, I didn't expect her to, to be like that and I didn't expect her to be able to, to dance a little bit. So, yeah, it's it's crazy to people think that, like, that people are saying I'm one to watch. I feel like, oh, it's a lot of pressure. I think it's a good thing. I think they're like, oh, we can see some magic in this yeah, one. Yeah, no, I'm really <laughs> happy know? that people can kind of see that I'm putting my 
like my best into it. Um, and yeah, hopefully we'll progress and progress every week. Well, well progressing to onto this week, we're going back to Latin and you're doing a samba to yes. this. At the Copa, hey. Copa, Copa. Hey. Barry Manilow, Mazarem. What a tune. It's such a loved song. I know that Vito had no idea what the song was. But you know, Ellie, we know. Yeah. Does that add pressure because it's such a big song? Yeah, it really does. I mean, I feel like everybody loves this song. Like, it's my uncle's favourite song. So, <laughs> like, no pressure. What's your uncle's name? My Uncle John. Big up, Uncle, Uncle John. John. This is um, for you. This is for you. Yeah. Yeah, um, it is a massive, massive song and everybody knows it and you want to make sure that you're doing a good job of, of the song as well. So, yeah, Samba in. So this week, your name is Lola. I am Lola. And you're a showgirl. And I'm a showgirl. Oh, yeah. I love it. You know, you've had tentaculas. You've had the lula hoop. Yeah. So for Samba, Vita, what's the, what's the word for this week? I want her to be <laughs> a good phoenix. Oh, phoenix. a phoenix. Yeah. 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 Because the Samba, you know, is a dance. I want to say, I want to be a bit wild, but also I want to be fire. I want her to bring fire on the dance floor, yeah. you know? And so the phoenix is the representation of the fire. The phoenix. You know I mean? But being Lola. You know, being Lola, Lola with the Lola Phoenix. With the 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 Showgirl fans. with the Phoenix. Yeah, exactly. Okay, yeah. I've got it, I've got it. Do you know, if you need any help getting away from him, just blink <laughs> Please. twice. I will be right there. <laughs> Good luck for this week in training. Thank you. It's Thank Ellie you. and Vito. Thank <laughs> Thanks to all of tonight's guests. Jeanette will be back tomorrow at 6.30 with Eddie and Karen, Jody and Yavita and Angela and Kai. Plus, She'll be talking to the one and only Amy Dowden. You do not want to miss that. Have a great evening. Come on.